Hey guys, so I want to do a video kind of reviewing and comparing two Louis Vuitton wallets that I have. Now these are two affordable wallets. They both fall under 500 US dollars before tax and they are the Zippy coin purse and the Josephine wallet. Now I mentioned to pretty much everyone I knew last year how much I wanted a Louis Vuitton wallet and I was given both of these as birthday gifts and I absolutely love them. I don't think you necessarily need both of them. I think I'm going to kind of talk about what I like about each one of them. You can kind of make a decision of which one's better for you. So I like to carry cash with me. I always have cash on me. I hate not having cash with me. And that's the one thing I don't like about the Zippy uh, coin purse. I don't think it's ideal for cash. So when you open it up, there are two spots for cards on both sides and then a little compartment in the back. I don't really put anything in there. And then there's like this divider in the middle. I do have some cash in here as an example, but I think this wallet can get a little crowded. So I just pretty much like to have like, um, I have like a Metro card right here. I have a gift card right now just as a space holder, but normally I would carry my debit card, my license, and a Metro card. And then this would be a great wallet to just put your key into so you can get like into your apartment or anything like that. So this is like an ideal, perfect going out wallet for someone that does not like cash. So I like it. It's uh, $390, so it's a little expensive for how small it is. It's just canvas, and then it has this gold zipper all the way around it. And when I buy anything from Louis Vuitton, my new attitude is usually when it's a smaller item, I like it to be in denier. I think the monogram can get kind of lost on the item because the LV can't really be appreciated on something that's super small. So yeah, that's just my opinion on this wallet. And then I want to show you my um, favorite bag. I think this wallet fits perfectly in the favorite. I like to carry a phone charger when I go out too. So I have my phone, the wallet, and then you can fit a phone charger on the side for your iPhone and then the lip gloss and you're set, good to go. Everything you need to go out with. Now as for the Josephine, this wallet I really, really love. Um, so it has a little snap detail, nothing on the back. It's a three fold and there are four card spots and opening back here, a little compartment here and then this great little pouch that you can take out. And then this is actually connected all the way through. So just always keep that in mind because I know I would always have trouble like bending it sometimes if something got caught here. So just make sure you be careful what you put in the wall. You don't want to stretch it out or damage it. So this is $480, I'm almost positive. Um, I just want to double check. I know that they're very, very close in price. And in my mind, the Josephine looks like a little bit more of expensive of a wallet. There's a lot more to it. Um, yeah, $480. So I love the red interior. I think this is a great everyday wallet. You can fit your important cards in here. You can fit cash in here. You can fit pretty much anything in here. I feel like there's extra space. Um, and then what's really nice about this wallet is that you can take the little inside compartment out and then you can put your maybe license and debit card and a little cash and be good to go. And then you can just put this in your going out bag and it won't take up the entire bag because the Josephine wallet takes up the entire bag and then I can just fit my phone and I can't fit a phone charger. And I don't like that. It, I always like to have a phone charger with me because I feel like my phone dies a lot. So honestly, it's the easiest thing to find an outlet to charge in, whether I'm on the train coming home or I'm in a restaurant or I'm like waiting somewhere. I can always find somewhere to charge my phone. Or even if you're at someone's house before you go out, if you're just like, I'm going to charge my phone. It's awesome. So I always like to have a phone charger with me. And in this bag with the Josephine wallet, there's just not enough room. The wallet takes up a lot of space. So that's why I think this wallet's a little more multi-purpose for the day and evening because you can take the little pouch out. So, yeah. Overall, I think if I had to recommend a wallet, I would recommend the Josephine. Well, I love the Zippy one. Don't get me wrong. I think it's so cute. Um, I use cash, which is why I just think this is a better wallet for me. I don't think you can like shove it with cash though, don't get me wrong, I don't think it's like that great, but um, you can either put your cash in the bottom compartment right under here and be good, or you can even put um, cash in here, or if you want it to be like extra safe and like we're worried about something, you can like, if this was like a 20 or something, like you can put it in the bottom over here as like a little safe compartment, like 
emergency backup stash for the wallet. Um, but yeah, I think they're both really, really nice wallets. They are great depending on what your personal needs are. So yeah, um, but yeah, so a little bit of size comparison and then compared to the iPhone. Yeah, so it's a pretty big wallet. Um, this could even be used as like a clutch or if you just wanted to carry the wallet, it's great. You're not gonna carry this. I feel like you're gonna lose something, but your phone doesn't fit in here though. Um, I mean, you could kind of clip it like that, but that would stretch out the wallet and it's not very secure this way, but the idea is that I do sometimes just carry this wallet out and I feel perfectly fine with my phone and things like that. But yeah, that's a little quick comparison of the two. I kind of want to film a couple more Louis Vuitton videos. I was thinking about doing like a wish list, a, a collection, and then a review on each of the products now after I've had them for a while and I can let you know if they still kind of serve the same purpose in my life and if I still like them as much as when I dreamed and lusted over them because some of them, my opinions definitely have changed and I, it's not that I don't like it, but I think that once you use something, um, you realize how practical it truly is, which is kind of how I realized with these two wallets that um, while they're both beautiful, some serve a better purpose in my life than um, others and I think looking up reviews is definitely a good idea before you make a big purchase um, but those were both gifts I didn't say what wallet I wanted I just said I wanted a wallet and I think these are both great um, I did say I wanted I guess I kind of did say I wanted a wallet for my um, going out bag so that was why this one was a perfect recommendation and it serves the purpose of when I go out I love this wallet it is great to have with me but um, I'm not big with changing my wallets. I kind of do just like the idea of having one wallet and being set with that. So it's not like I need two wallets, but I do like that I have technically an everyday wallet and a going out vacation wallet. <laughs> okay, um, I think I've talked for a while about this. If you, guys, if you guys have any questions, just leave them below and I will try to answer them for you. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Bye everyone.